highlight my first video for the year 2023 it's been a, about a week in from the new year i haven't really had much of a thought about what to do with videos for the new year or even if i was going to do any videos this was just really going to be a test recording i was just going to play it back to myself but i might i might as well upload it to youtube if i don't ramble too much we'll see how we go i suppose so i've got the big bottom on the roadcaster pro i've also got the oral exciter on and neither of which are up too high at least i don't think so they're a bit more conservative although the oral exciter is i've got the mix or the strength of the oral exciter set to 50 so that's sort of up a little bit but i've got the harmonic set to i think it was about 30. so it's not too high, but the mix is up a little bit. I should probably, I reckon the mix is good to set it anywhere between about, I don't know, 30 and 50 for the Oral Exciter. So probably either 30 or 40, I'm guessing, but I just sort of push the envelope a little bit more and have it up to 50. So now you know how, how I've got things set up. The big bottom is fairly conservative. There's a bit of bass, but not it's not turned up too much, but just a bit to give a bit more body to, to my voice down the low end. Now the main purpose of this video is to check out the three band equalizer in the audio filters in OBS Studio. Now for reference, I'm using OBS Studio version 29.0.0 beta 3. I do have the three band equalizers turned on at the moment, but the high frequencies, the mids and the low, they're all set to zero. So I suppose you could say it's as good as having them turned off. I'm gonna get this road cover off my lap and stop being lazy the only thing that i think that i'm really lacking in the way of audio is the mid frequencies all right so the three bands graphic equalizer in obs studio here we go 3 db boost for the mid tones it's on right now so that's the three band graphic equalizer in obs studio with a 3 db mid frequency boost only so no change to the highs or lows in the three band equalizer in OBS Studio because high and low, just to remind again, that is on zero. Only mid is on three. I'm gonna turn the uh, three band off again and then I'm gonna put on six dB for the mid boost. So three dB boost and now the, equal, the equalizer is turned off right now. Click, okay, there, there you go. So that was three dB, that was three dB boost. I'm gonna turn the graphic equalizer on six dB. So I've just turned the graphic equalizer on 6 dB. I'll just turn it off again. One, two, three, four. It's still turned on. This is 6 dB mid, mid frequency boost. Okay, and it's on. And the equalizer is turned off again now. So that's the equalizer off. And now I'm gonna, I'm gonna let's just do a recap. Let's get the keyboard handy. So this is the equalizer off. That is 3 dB boost. Okay, that is 3 dB boost for the mids. One, two, three, four. And that is 6 dB boost. So there you go, that's 6 dB. So which do you prefer? Do you like the 3 dB boost for the mid? Now, I'm not going to compare it with the off now. I'm just going to compare which you think is better with 3 or 6. Because I don't want to have it turned off. I want to have it turned on. But I'm just trying to decide, do I have it on 3 dB for the mid-range boost? Just to give my voice a bit more presence with the Rode Broadcaster. Being a fairly bassy mic, I don't want it quite as bassy. So um, I'm thinking maybe 3 dB. So do you think 3 sounds okay like this for the mid-range boost? Or or 6 dB boost like that? So it's 6 dB boost for the mid-range for the 3 band equalizer in OBS Studio 29. 6 dB boost for the mid-range and, and 3 dB boost for the mid-range. Anyway, just let me know what you think. That would be very much appreciated because uh, 2 or 3 or 4 mines are better than 1, I reckon. That's all for now and uh, check in with you later.